GCSC Maths expanding triple brackets in just over two minutes. Let's go. This is a super common exam question. Let's have a look. It says show that 3x minus 1 multiplied by x plus 5 multiplied by 4x minus 3 can be expressed as 12x cubed plus 47x squared minus 62x plus 15. Guys, we're going to have to expand those brackets, avoiding any silly mistakes. What can we do? First off, we're going to have 3x minus 1 multiplied by our x plus 5. Here, we're expanding double brackets, so we're going to use our FOIL method first. 3x times by x is 3x squared. Our outer, 3x times by 5 is 15x. Next, our inner minus 1 times by x, we're going to have minus x. Our last minus 1 times by 5, we're going to have minus 5. Collecting our like terms, we have 3x squared, 15x minus x, that's going to be 14x. And we have our minus 5 on the end. Next step, we're going to have to multiply this, which was equal to 3x minus 1 times by x plus 5, by this, our 4x minus 3. So we're going to have 3x squared plus 14x minus 5 multiplied by our 4x minus 3. Now, guys, we're going to have to multiply each of the terms in our first bracket by each of the terms in our second bracket. Pause it, give this a go. 3x squared times by 4x, that's going to be 12x cubed. Next up, 3x squared times by minus 3, that one is going to be minus 9x squared. Next, we have our 14x times by our 4x, 14 times by 4, that's going to be 56, so we have 56x squared. Next up, 14x times by 3, 14 by 3 is 42, so we're going to have minus 42x. Next up, we have minus 5 times by 4, 4x, that's going to give us our minus 20x. And finally, minus 5 times by minus 3, that's going to be positive 15. Next, we're going to collect our like terms, guys. We have one term in x cubed, so we have our 12x cubed. Next up, our terms in x squared, we have minus 9x squared plus 56x squared. 56 subtract 9 is 47, so we have plus 47x squared. Next up, our x's, we have minus 42x, minus 20x. Combining those, we're going to get minus 62x. Finally, our plus 15 on the end. And guys, the beauty of this question is you can check if you're right. Are we correct? Did we get 12x cubed plus 47x squared minus 62x plus 15? Yes, we did, guys. So we know we must be right.